The snow on the surface starts melting. The familiar rail cars are now joined with boats and fishermen. One of them appeared just in the nick of time. Soon we'll be docked at Venice. Pavel is most probably already there. I don't usually fish in this tunnel, but I had a hunch they'd be fighting pretty good here. I feel like I should probably die. Ah! Oh, man. You've got to be careful here. There's more than just fish in that water. You see for yourself, we can do Grab the railing when I want you. That's cool, I can kind of move around through it. I feel like that's gonna hit me. <laughs> oh man, bump my head. Are you alright? Oh, sorry, I, I didn't warn you about the logs. Thought you'd figure it out by yourself. This gun looks like it's just like six shot yeah, right? It just it looks like it's six uh, soda cans put together Nobody to make a shot in the middle. We call them creeps. Ugly as well. It almost looks like a potato can. Double barrel is better for like running and gunning. The semi auto is better for this kind of station. Hold on, I'm young! Oh, 
Wow, this doesn't happen often. Looks like we lucked out. The subterranean Venice, an island on the dark waters of underground rivers. You always hear rough stories circulating about this place. I hear it is all one huge den of thieves. But there is something I know for sure. Pavel reached Venice, and if I'm not late, he's still here. Finding the Dark One is still my main mission. But now I see I must also uncover Corbett's plans so that I can warn the Order about them. Wow. <sighs> Seems like we made it. Hey, are you asleep there? What do you think of the local fish, huh? Aren't they charming? Mm, seem moody, though. Looks like somebody went through there before us and angered them. Open up! The fishermen are back from the seas! Yeah, I see you, all right. And who might that be? I picked the guy up in the tunnel. You don't think I should have left him there, do you? What? And make my life easy? Of course not. And I keep raising and lower the gate. You can bring a girl for once. And what would you do with one if I brought her, Semenovich, huh? You're way too old for that stuff. By the way, you better lower the gate. Or else a woman might actually come. The one dressed in black and bearing a scythe. <laughs> Never fear. Semenovich is going to outlive you all. Hey, Fidor, how's fishing? Uh, not even a bite, unless you count the shrimps. And they got a few more out of me than I'd like. I was saved by this lad, Artyom. Nice to meet you, Artyom. Thanks for your help. So what exactly did happen? The shrimps were all over us as soon as we got to the fork. Almost took my raft apart. Uh, what the hell gives? Uh, wonder. Oh, that's easy. The Reds passed through here, going to meet our esteemed neighbors. Didn't seem to care what they stirred up. Ah, so that's why. Look, Artyom, I suppose there is no hiding. Venice is full of gangsters. Julian, the scum of the earth. So don't you start any shit. I don't want any trouble. Simon! Hey! Simon! I want to talk to you! Look! Do you know where might our red guests be? In the brothel, of course. Who's that with you? This is Artyom, the scourge of the shrimps. <laughs> you should see him shoot. <laughs> I never met anyone quite as good as him. A gunslinger, eh? Would you help me take out a few bad guys? Simon, I freaking knew it. This is getting old. But almost all of them are gathered at the storage facility. Look. If this isn't the right time, I don't know what is. Between the two of us, we might be able to take them out. I told you countless times already, and I'm going to tell you again. No! I don't need this shit around here. Do you get me? Yeah, I got you. Right. Then I'm going to leave you two. Okay. In this station of criminals, how is it he's in charge? Hey, Simon. You're good with engines, aren't you? Yeah, what's up? Alright, let's go kind of explore this area. We're pretty full on everything, so I just want to see what guns they have here. Probably that. Oh, what do we have here? This way. I need to get a rope. There it is. No, no, no. What the fuck? Oh, wow. Yeah, the rifle. That gun is a beast. Buy it. Oh, okay. Yeah, do I want to trade this guy? 
No, I'm going to save those bullets just because if I need them in the future for upgrades or Look, man, that's a real even uh, if I need them to like, fight like, the final boss in the game, if there is one, I'm going to need those bullets probably to fire out my, my assault rifle. You call yourself a man. So I'm not going to browse around here too much. You wouldn't be asking. I'm just going to uh, see where they want us to go. All right, let's go up here. Just don't hurt the What about from your local boss, bitch? Sure. We don't have bosses here. Are you crazy? They're friends with Kizzy. Are you sure? Great. I have to serve all his friends for All right, we had some fun. Now it's time for work. So, first thing, oh, we pay shit. Kizzy and you head to Comrade guy. Corbett. Tell him the virus container's been successfully delivered to Octyabrska, okay? What kind of dance would you like, sweetie? Tell me. Oh, she That's screwed all? me out of getting that guy. I'm saying, really. If you decide to come back, I'm always around. That's like a reason to stay here. Where did you get all those pictures? Mm -hmm. Where's he at? Let's go. All right, let's get him. Fresh meat nuggets, great prices today. Come to market. What are you getting? Getting away from me this time. No one has to know. Ammo. Yeah, I'm always worried about running out of ammo in this game, even if I have tons of ammo. It's just the way I am. Because you never know when you're going to need a whole bunch. Especially since I uh, I did a playthrough of Tom Clancy's The Division a while back, and I even ran out of ammo in that game. In that game, there's like restock spots everywhere, just because of my play style. I like to use it. Oh, 
just dropping a whole bunch of whole bunch of pistol ammo, so let's let's use our pistol for a bit. I haven't used it that much. Oh, might as well turn that off. I think there's one guy left up here. Maybe not. Drop your weapon, Zayet. Hands behind your head. Well, 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 what an unexpected encounter. Looking for the dark one? Huh? You gotta be kidding me. Well, I'm maybe there's a hope for you again. and Polis. But then, um, you're too late. Yeah. Those dark ones of yours are the real deal, yeah. Comrade Corbett had an eye on them for a long time. Just imagine them domesticated, then unleashed on the enemy. <laughs> Hey, 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 steady, oh, steady, steady now. All right, all right, you're on top, D'Artagnan, you are on top. What now? Uh, you were looking for the dark one, right? Well, he is nearby, at Oktyabrskaya. I can take you there. No tricks this time, you have my word. Everyone on the ground, now! Artyom? No! Shit, he got away. Why did you attack the storage alone? You could have tried to call me. Well, things worked out. But you'll have to get out of here on the double. I know an exit to the surface here. There's a swamp, but it's traversable. Let's go. Okay, I don't get it. I don't I don't know who this guy is. Oh, is he the he must have been the guy I met on the dock there. He looks a little different. I was gonna say the boat driver guy, he had a big old mustache. So, it's not him. Everyone looks the same in this game. Put this on. That's for the gangsters. Oh, what is that? Like a diving suit? 